Hello there. Welcome to another episode of Retro Gaming Red eBay Stuff Unboxing Video. Yup. This time around, I get um, again some Sega cartridge from a seller in Europe. My may I know why he ship all this stuff in the shoebox? <laughs> Seriously, it look kind of weird. Yeah, it's a Reebok shoebox. I'm on Reebok. Yeah. Okay. Do, I don't want to delay this video any longer. So hold on. Why? Unbox this piece of shit up. <laughs> Give me some time. Right, right, man. Okay. Let's open up this treasure box okay there's an invoice as usual of what I order I'm quite professional luckily this is wrapped it in the bubble pack to avoid damaging the boxes yeah nice shoe box show you on side alright oh, man okay First of all, I bought a Mega Drive 1 AV cable. Yep. In case it needs foundations. Anyway, the seller is good enough to give me this for free. Yeah. Since I bought some other game from him also. Anyways, thanks. Because I just bought the so called the Asia Pell Mega Drive. It doesn't come with AV cable, just the standard RF. Okay, the first game Red Zone. I remember a lot of magazines are saying it offered the graphics very good at that time. Hmm, the box is quite badly. It's quite bad. But anyway, I don't pay a lot for it, so I don't expect very good quality anyway. Yeah. It's quite badly damaged. Well, it's a 20 over years product, so I don't expect much. At least the menu and the cartridge is still intact. Read zone. Later at night, I'll give it a test run. Second. Gunship. Yeah, I know it is. It has very bad review, but anyway, it's, if I'm not wrong, it's only released in Europe. So, since I already all since I already ordered something from him myself, I'll just get everything. One thing I don't like about European uh, packaging is the menu keep on dropping out. Regardless how you want to put it, as usual, it's completed. Box. Sorry for my bad English, actually, I'm not, you know. <sighs> okay, never mind. Third, yes. And this is the main reason why I get from him is a blade of vengeance the European version wow cool looking have to look like see, see all the manual couple seriously and I'm the only one who like the EA cartridge it look damn cool see the menu is black and white okay I'm gonna play this uh, these are order for fun yeah, I know it's a very crappy Batman game. Yeah, starring Penguin and Catwoman. It's Batman Returns. As normal, it's completed in box and got menu. Yes, and the menu start popping out again. Yeah, I see it's blank white. I'm not going to play this one seriously. If I'm going to play this one, I'd rather play the Sega CD version. At least it got nice driving stage. But not this. Two of the exclusive Sega Mega Drive game. Told you, man. This is a real time strategy game or real time action game, and it says it's very well done. Seriously, I never played this before because 10 years back, I don't think I got the chance to play this anyway. Yeah, I cannot afford every game in the so called. Uh, 
market. Sometimes I can only look at them. You cannot do much about it. Yeah, so example, another exclusive great game from Sega. Yeah. And last one, I believe it's a sequel. It's a Toe Jam era panic on Funkatron. Yeah, as usual, it's also completed with menu and box. I like to collect games when it's completed in menu and box. Sometimes I don't blame anyone. It's 30 over years old. Sometimes menu may be missing this and that, but seriously, at least it might come with a box. Uh. From retrospective point of view, at least it looks cool, man. We're gonna put on display. No menu, never mind, but I have the box. Okay, that's all for today. Thanks for watching. See you. Bye bye.